actually kind of cool. Let me see if I can sit it somewhere where you can see it. Look at this. It's a tray with bats on it. $19.99. Oh, I feel like that's a little expensive for Ross. Ross would have something like this, $14.99, but it's heavy. It's a nice little piece. So we're in Ross and it's really messy, but they're starting to put out a few of their Halloween pillows. Get this one. He's cute. Um, $10.99. There's another one up here. Let's see. This one looks like, oh, oh. It's just a regular ghost. $12.99. He's cute. And then I saw these little fluffy ghost pillows. And they are starting to put out their dish towels. Ross has some really cute ones. Look at these little donuts. It reminds me of the Valentine's Day ones. And they're super cheap. There's more towels. Ooh, these are cool. Skulls and bones. Oh my god. And look. Ross has the best towels. Like the absolute best. Oh, let me see what the back of those says. Oh, there's a separate. Cute. Huge stackable pumpkin is $40. It's huge. So I guess this is where they're going to start putting all the Halloween. Still kind of has a lot of other stuff all over here. But I guess it's coming. Look at this. Bowl. Hope it doesn't fall out. That's cute for $12.99. Back in Michael's, I did not notice this little haunted house. This is, look at the little mommy in the front. Darling. This one is, excuse me, $19.99, and it is 40% off no idea these were here so there's a few new items at michael's did we see this one the last time i don't think we did how darling and i don't remember seeing this Let's see this one's 19 yep 19.99 as well they got a few new items here Oh my god, can y'all see that? It's a witch's hat. Oh my god. So cute. Like I said, if I didn't have small children, I would do stuff like this. Small children or a dog. I would definitely create my own little haunted house. So cute. I think I see, I didn't see these either. is gorgeous and it's not a lot of glitter on it i really love this this one is $14.99 this looks like it goes with the haunted forest collection that is beautiful it looks like they just set a bunch of the Haunted Mansion or Haunted Forest stuff over here. This looks new. Let's see what that picture looks like. Oh, I love this. Oh, wow. So they're slowly getting stuff in. You guys know I love these every year. 
they do them so well. Like they place them together so well. I was actually looking for the Hocus Pocus collection. I think it's the Hocus Pocus collection, but it's the black, white, and orange collection. I don't think it's out just yet. But they did add some new stuff. That pillow is new. And it's coming, but it's not here just yet. So I came over to the bead section because I'm looking for some uh, beads to do a fall DIY. Look how stinking adorable these are. They have Christmas ones, Easter. How adorable. I would love to make a cute little Halloween bracelet with these little candy corns. I need to get back in my creative bag Look at the little skulls. I didn't even know stuff like this existed, but they're so cute and dainty. I gotta get back in my bag, y'all. Blanket that I'm looking for, I'll pop it up on the screen here. I think it's being found on TJ Maxx. I don't know yet, but I have not come across anything that remotely looks like that. And I want it so bad, <laughs> but I don't know, we'll keep searching. This is gorgeous for a little girl's room, $24.99. And these little hooded towels for kids. This is just like a deck on lantern head. Oh my god, a little ghost. Yeah, orange one. Look at these little wash mitts. The towels are slowly showing up. So cute. I love this. We saw the tumblers from Home Goods, but really cute. Look at that one. This is more of what I like. Pier, Disney, more Halloween, peanuts. seen these yet? I don't think so. Look. So darling. 29? Whoa. They're gorgeous but $29? Whew. Also adorable. Stinking adorable. Alright I know this isn't Halloween related but I feel like it is. Does this guy give you like Halloween vibes? Like the dripping design?
TJ Maxx has a few more items out. A little Snoopy. Looks like some measuring cups. Oh, uh, it has Snoopy on it. I am not a fan of the Snoopy. But they have plenty. This pumpkin is really cool. Oh, and look at these glasses. Uh, this is glass or plastic? Ooh, these feel really nice. Really, really cool. Oh, is this a spooky? It is. Do we need this? Oh my god, that's so cute. I'm trying to see if I need this. I don't want to just get stuff because I see it. This was actually really cute. But they have a green one that has eek over it that I like. I feel like I have a lot of orange. And I don't want to buy things just because I see it. So, yeah. But this, oh my god. It's two of them. It's two in one. How stinking cute. These are nice. Let's boogie. And what's this back here? It is a Hydro Peak. That's cute. I'm seeing this one, the white one. This one's cool. I always saw the black one in this. They do have the orange ones. Man, I just want to see the black ones. I need a black one in this style. So bad. are really cute but not something I need see I remember I told y'all in that video these are still here nobody wants these I don't think these will last here because these were like measuring cups that people actually liked like look at that that's so cool and then so cute $14.99. Guys, I'm obsessed with these. Look how cute these are. And then they have the matching, like, couple. I just think those would be so cute for a little girl's room. They have a different kind as well. A little sequin one. Those are darling for a little girl's room. $9.99. So how cute is this? Oh, I gotta be careful with this because I could break it. It's a little candle holder. $14.99. I know the ghosty girls would love something like that. That with like a black candle in it would be really cute. How adorable is this? Like the pink girls. They are showing up for y'all. I'm, I'm thinking these are little ghosts. But if you have a pink kitchen. Wow. Also, I think, I feel like I need this for the house. It's a bag clip for the cheese. I mean cheese, chips. You guys don't know how many times bags of chips go opened in my house and nobody Nobody, nobody decides to either close them. This is a great idea. Also, that's such a mom. That's such a mom item. It's always nice to see the sheets that they have for 
Halloween. It's really pretty. And of course they have peanuts. This is cute for a little girl's room. It's pink, not Halloween, but it's pink. Oh. That's for a queen and it's done, wow. Nice. The brooms are really cute. If the broom fits, fly it. Oh my goodness. That's really, that's darling. And it has this adorable little spider on it. Cute. Always get choked up coming over here. Marley could actually still wear something like this because she's, even though she's five, she's very small. So a 3T still fits on her. That is so cute. And it's only $8.99. I don't think that's Halloween, but look at this. So cute. Is that Paw Patrol? I think so. Oh, they have little sleeping. Oh no, these are headbands. My daughter would love that. Whoa, 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 everything's falling. So we got a cat head spa band. There's, what is this back here? Let's see, let me get it, let me get it down. Bear with me. It's a spider web. Oh my goodness, my daughter would love this for Halloween. Oh. It wouldn't be a trip with Tasha without knocking down everything, so. <gasps> There's more little ghosties. They have a, a Minnie Mouse. There's a witch's hat. Darling. I didn't even know this stuff existed. There's another one down here. There's a shower cap that's a Halloween version. And a Hello Kitty. Oh, for the Hello Kitty girls, they do have a Halloween one. Adorable. I did want to come and look at some of the fall dispensers. Let me start. I hope I'm breathing. I'm not breathing hard into the camera. But I'm starting to get into these a lot more. Look at this one. It's like iridescent. And then they got this cute little scroll. So you guys, I like to put stuff like this in the girls' bathroom. Uh, just so it's festive. And they're not using my... I feel like it's my good bath and body works pumpkin spice so they have a lot of cute little scents here looking at this got me thinking why hasn't anybody done like an authentic makeup collab involving Halloween I know we've had some in the past but as big as Halloween is, Mac, um, Ulta, somebody could have come out with like a crazy collab just featured around Halloween. It would kill the game. Look at this. This is cool. It's just brushes. I think there's another one back there. Yeah. Can you imagine like a eyeshadow palette for Halloween that's centered around like Halloween colors? Some people would just want that to have it. Missing out on money, y'all.
other two gen x they have more stuff look at this boogie boogie man i've never seen her she's like levitating they have some cool candles zombie espresso spooky pumpkin spice spider venom and chai i don't like any of these like because they have like a latte or a coffee smell so i usually pass up on those they have like drink mixes that's cool and look at this everybody's killing it with their packaging for candles See this one already? There's no way this is ten dollars. Ten dollars? That has to be wrong. Wow. Oh God! Here we go. These are actually cute little ghost measuring cups but look still just sitting here <laughs> guys I think we need this haunted house I'm not gonna find anything like this for ten dollars anywhere else yeah we're gonna get it portion of the video there's only one thing here so we're gonna make this short and sweet I I saw this I saw this on someone's page I think Daniel showed it in one of his uh, walkthroughs and I fell in love with it and I when he showed it I didn't see it in store so I wasn't sure how big it was how small it was I'm pretty sure it was Daniel that's the only person that's coming to mind right now with this particular item but I wanted to see it in person, and when I saw it in person, I fell in love. It's the haunted house! Now, I know I got the haunted house from Big Lots, and I love that one. But this one is so classic. Look at this. And the glitter didn't bother me. Usually when there's glitter on items, it's usually obnoxious, but I, I love this. I actually like the glitter on this. I had to get this one. It does light up. It's a very faint light. It's it's really similar to the one that I got from uh, Big Lots where the light changes all different colors. I love this. So, so, so cute. There are only two left in store. I picked up the first one and when I got to the register and I turned it around, 
it was cracked on the back so i immediately ran to the back and grabbed the other one ten dollars is the economy trying to correct itself because ten dollars in this economy is insane this is this would have this would have been 20 to 25 dollars anywhere else last year i couldn't leave this one on the shelf so i love this this is one of my one of my favorite per i'll say that i say that with everything but it truly is one of my favorite purchases and i love it so i'm gonna end this video and i want to thank you guys i have reached 3k on the channel i'm so excited about that i appreciate all of you guys from the bottom of my heart even if i had 200 subscribers i would love and appreciate you guys because you don't have to be here like you don't have to subscribe to my channel you don't have to watch my videos but you do and you're here and i appreciate you some of you know i had an old channel that i started off with when i started on youtube and the direction that it was going in i just didn't like so i just wanted to start fresh and focus on things that i was really into and that was more of my decorating side my decor not so much my personal life but what you guys see as far as like what my passion is what i love to do my hobbies so that's why i created this channel and it has grown so fast i think i started this channel two years ago something like that and it has grown so fast i'm so thankful i'm so blessed again if there were only 150 of you guys i would still be just as appreciative that you're here because again you don't have to watch my videos you may not even be interested in what i'm talking about so i'm appreciative whether i have 100 subscribers or 3,000 subscribers so thank you guys thank you guys for 3k and i will see you in my next video happy hunting Thank you.